What's going on, Ann Crew? My name is Andrew. Welcome back to a brand new exciting video. All right, so today, whew, have you guys ever been watching like a vlog or a tutorial or some kind of YouTube video and you've seen some kind of like motion graphic just like pop up on the screen? And this YouTuber uploads all the time and pretty much in every single one of their videos, they have these cool motion graphics just going on in the video. And you have to ask yourself, is this person really going through every single video and hand making those motion graphics? The answer is probably no. They're not. It's just unrealistic to try to make every single motion graphic and title in your videos by hand specifically for each video. So that's why people use things called MoGarts or motion graphic templates. Essentially all of it is is some kind of cool text animation like this or this or this. That you can just throw up on the screen, change the text, and you're good to go. So today I am really excited. I'm partnering up with AE Rocket to drop 10 free cinematic motion graphics for your video. So be sure to head down to the description of this video, slap that Google Drive link, and you guys will be able to download your 10 free cinematic motion graphics. There's also going to be a link there to purchase the full length pack, which has over 280 motion graphics for you guys to use. This pack is absolutely incredible. So be sure to check that out and see if that's something that you guys want to look into actually picking up. Alright everybody, so I'm on the computer now, and the first thing you're going to do is head down to the description of this video and go to the Google Drive link and just download the free pack. When you download it, you're going to unzip the file, and then you're just going to have a folder that's says cinematic demo. Go ahead and double click that double click cinematic demo again and then you can see we've got an After Effects project right here. Real quick though we want to make sure we download the fonts for this motion graphics pack so that everything lines up correctly. So you're going to double click this free font PDF. So you can just right click hit open link a new tab and here you can just start going through and downloading the fonts. Alright guys so now I just finished installing all of the free fonts. I'm going to go ahead and open up Premiere Pro and I'm going to go ahead and open up a video that I posted last week about the day to night transition. Alright so here's some of the footage. Let's just say I wanted to add a quick title right here. I can just go ahead and select this clip right here, right click, and hit replace with After Effects Composition. What I can do is go over to this project panel and I can hit Control I on PC or Command I on Mac. You can go ahead and navigate on your computer to wherever you stored your file. Go ahead and select that After Effects file and hit import. Cool, so now we've got this nice cinematic demo project right here and it has 10 free files for us, which is insane. Cool, so to use one of the files, you can just go ahead and select, say, the first folder, open that up. It's going to have an image there, and you can just take this first title composition here and drag it down on top of your footage. Now you can see when you play it through, it's got this nice title here and everything like that, but it does have that image in the background. Now that image is just being used as a placeholder for you to fill in. You don't have to actually leave it there, don't worry. So what you can do is just go into the main file and where it says image, just delete that. And there you go, now you've got this nice, easy, cinematic title motion graphic. And it's really useful, it's just a nice, simple, minimalist title that expedites our workflow and is really useful for people like freelancers, wedding videographers, cinematographers, and people like that. Now we'll just try another one. Let's go down to cinematic title seven. We'll drag that in. Actually, this is six. We'll drag that composition in. All you have to do is double click on the title itself and that brings you into the editing controls. Now real quick, we'll just turn off this background image because we don't need that. And you want to change the text. You just select the text and hit control T to bring up the tools and you can just type in something new. The producer could be some dude named James Andrew, there you go. And now it's going to come up nice and sleek. Producer James Andrew. Let's change this one to Gaffer uh, Andrew James. <laughs> and so now we've got James Andrew being the producer. The Gaffer is Andrew James. And then it has this nice cinematography reel right there. You could change that to your logo if you wanted. So let's say I wanted a new logo. Boom, that's sleek. That looks good. Maybe I'll change my logo to that. Who knows? That's a great font right there. And you can just easily make a nice intro for your videos. Let's keep messing around with this. We'll do this one more time. Let's try one of these lower thirds ones. These are great for YouTube videos. Let's see what this looks like. This is perfect. Learn how to create live captions in Adobe Premiere Pro. It's actually that easy. You just drag and drop it in. It looks really professional. It's easy and sleek. One thing I want to point out is that some of these effects work directly inside of Premiere Pro. So you can just go straight to Premiere Pro. But not all of the effects work. It just depends on what title you use. Otherwise, it might have some limited functionality. For example, Cinematic 01, that works with both programs totally fine. But then Cinematic 08 and 04 only work inside of After Effects because the font contours to the video a little bit. And then there's some color grading and stuff like that. 
like that. So that's just something to uh, keep in mind. But now let's try out this cinematic 07. We'll just drag and drop that onto our composition. Now earlier what I did to get rid of this background was I just double clicked in and turn off the footage or deleted it. But technically that's not what you're really supposed to do and you're not going to get all the effects with certain titles if you do that. So what you should do for all the titles is just copy the footage, delete it from this composition, double click to go into the title, and then double click to go into the image, image 01, and then paste the footage in there. And now you can see we've got the footage replacing the background and it looks really clean. Let's try another one out. Let's try cinematic 08 and we'll copy our footage again, double click, double click to go into the image and paste it. Now check this out guys. Watch around the mouth. Watch how it kind of contours around my body like that and just the movement of the video. You can see contouring a little bit there and just wiggling around a bit. You can see that text wiggling as well. I have no idea how this is made but it is super cool. There's this nice sort of grain overlay so that looks really sick and you can literally edit it right here say Andrew James. So yeah, you guys can see that that looks really, really sick. I love the contour. So there's just a bunch of little details like that that make these titles such a good deal. I mean, these are free, so you can't get a better deal than free, am I right? The full version also has ready screen resolutions for Instagram or videos. So if you want to change the screen resolution for like an Instagram video or something like that, they're already pre-made for you to do that. There's also a help file in there in case you guys need any help. And then there's also a promo code for an extended license. So if you guys head over to the link in the description to buy the pack. If you buy the extended license, you'll get 50% off. If you use the promo code hashtag Andrew James to submit the promo code, you're going to buy the graphics pack, the extended license. Then you're going to fill out a contact form under the link that I provided in the description. And there you're just going to enter a hashtag Andrew James. You're going to get 50% off the extended license and you'll get an additional set of super cool titles that can be used in commercial projects as well. So if you're looking into getting the extended license, definitely be sure to use the hashtag Andrew James promo code. And there you have it guys. I hope you enjoyed those free 10 cinematic motion graphics. They're so, so cool and so useful. Now that we've gone over the 10 free effects, if you're not interested in buying a pack or anything like that, you guys can go ahead and just leave this video. But if you are interested in potentially picking up this full length pack, I'm going to do a quick overview of what you guys should expect. All right, guys. So AE Rocket put together a little video demonstrating the entire pack. It's got a ton of super cool features. You're definitely going to want to check it out. So I'm going to go ahead and play that video now and I'll see you guys at the end. And there you guys have it. There's the 10 free effects and a quick overview of the full length pack. Let me know what tutorials and breakdowns you guys want to see in the future down in the comments below. Be sure to give me a follow on Instagram at AndrewJMES. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to get outside, film a video, make a difference, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.